We are living through a defining moment for our generation. Our generation is the generation that was supposed by our predecessors to be saved from scourge of war. That is why our predecessors created the United Nations. And yet today, it falls to us to save future generations. They have come to deprive Ukraine of the very right to exist. They have come to resolve the Ukrainian issue as their propagandists claimed, just stop and think whether these wars remind you of something. Yes, more than 80 years ago, another dictator tried to finally resolve the issue of another people. He failed when the world responded in a resolute and united manner it was happened immediately, and the delay costed dozens of millions of people. Are we ready to pay such a price now? One might consider, observing the bloodshed in Ukraine, that it is not my war. It is a mistake. The evil will never stop. It requires more and more space to conquer. If tolerated, it advances further and further. The draft resolution is one of the building blocks to build a wall to stop it. After the vote, I invite you ambassadors and representatives to stop by the Indonesian lounge and to sign this little blue book. Little but of global magnitude. Every vote in favor of the resolution and every signature of country that voted in favor would be a historical reconfirmation of the Charter. It is very easy, ladies and gentlemen, to sign the Charter at time of peace. It is the duty to sign and reconfirm and implement the Charter at the time of war.